What are some daily practices we can do to recognize the suffering around us without getting depressed about it? People don't get what they try to get or want to get. People lose what they have. You know, what they want doesn't happen. What they don't want happens. You know, and all these uh, things that's happening around the world. You know, there's wars, there's famines, there's pandemic, there is you know economic and um, political and all kind of you know. Uh, problems and difficulties and uh, all these are suffering you know this this brings uh, lots of pain and problem to the people these are suffering you know? so okay. therefore I think it is uh, we don't need too much to, uh, to to do to find we just have to observe uh, I think to to see or to um, to um, understand to see suffering is I think easy. The important thing is, you know, uh, that there is suffering. There is lots of suffering, and there's always been suffering. It's not that just because we have a pandemic, we have lots of suffering. It's not like that. There's always suffering, there's always death, there is always, you know, sickness, there is always, you know, uh, all kind of things happening that people are suffering from, you know. Uh, the, the thing is, is there anything that we can do to, uh, of course, we can do things to, uh, little bit change the situation and become better you know uh, if we are sick we can take medicine and sometimes we can get better uh, or sometimes we can control the sickness for long time or short time uh, but you know we cannot do something that we will never ever get sick you know therefore we need something some inner uh, ability that uh, even if we are sick, you know, of course we have physical pain and things like that, but it wouldn't bring too much, you know, uh, emotional, mental, you know, uh, suffering. Uh, and that, you know, needs. Uh, what you can sometimes call spiritual practice. Um, so therefore, you know, from Buddhist point of view, there is a possibility to do that. And this is the training. Uh, <laughs> it's not easy, maybe. Of course it's not easy. But there is a possibility. So many people, you know, uh, who are really good practitioners, uh, you know, uh, they can go through lots of difficulties with uh, with kind of uh, without too much uh, depression or you know mental and emotional suffering. 